Hello students. So let us see the question number four from IIT Jam 2023. So in this question, they have given you Gina diode and a normal diode connected, V injection diode connected in parallel. And they have given you V input value as five sine 200 pi T volts. Okay. So the peak to peak voltage of this input wave is five volts. Okay. And they're asking what is the waveform of output voltage? Okay, what is the waveform of output voltage? So as you can see, this diode, okay, are the reverse bias by three volt battery and the reverse voltage, uh, reverse bias voltage for this Gina diode is given three volt, okay? And if we want to conduct these diode in forward bias, so forward bias voltage for both these diode is given uh, 0 0.7 volt. Okay, so 0 0.7 volt is the forward bias voltage for your this diode, normal diode, as well as for this Gina diode. Okay, now let us see what happens. So initially, if you see, if whenever the voltage is less than three volts, okay, whenever the voltage is less than three or this diode as well as this diode, both are in both will this will be open. Okay because in order to make this diode conduct, your voltage should be uh, equal to the Gina diode, Gina's, Gina's reverse voltage, okay? And if you want to make this diode conduct, okay? So we need to apply the uh, V input greater than this three volt, as well as uh, if you want to make it conduct in, in forward bias. So there should be voltage of 0 point, uh, 0 0.7 volt, okay? So if you want to make this diode conduct, we need at least 3.7 volt. Okay, so let us see what happens. So now, so, so when we increase the input, okay, up to three volt, okay, this is also open. Okay, this, this, this is also open and, and, uh, and this is also open. Okay, this diode is uh, diode also open. So at three volts, this diode start conducting and the voltage become fixed volt output voltage become three volts. Okay, so before three volts, if I draw my output, Okay, in forward bias. Okay, so up to three volt. Okay, I'll get my V output equals to V input as it is. Okay, so up to three volt, I'll get this exactly equal equal to three volts. And once this voltage becomes three volt, input voltage becomes three volt. Okay, this diode will start conducting and the voltage will be fixed up to three volts, okay? So if you if anything beyond uh, three volts input, your output voltage is fixed to three volts, okay? Now, what happens again? When this is less than zero, zero volt again, you got V output equals to V input. So you get same thing here. So you get same input like this, okay? Now see what happens <coughs> when you, you reverse the cycle, okay? That means now this part is positive and this part is negative, okay? So when this part is positive, okay? This diode becomes forward bias, okay? This is still reverse bias. If you're applying more negative, this will be again reverse bias, okay? Because this we make plus, this is mine. This is already reverse bias. So this is also making reverse bias. So this diode will be always, always open. Now in forward bias, okay, when this is plus, this is minus, this diode will become forward bias and the forward bias voltage is given 0 0.7, okay? So as soon as the voltage of input reaches 0 0.7, after that, this with this, this diode diode become, a, can be treating, we can treat as like a battery and the voltage will be fixed 0 0.7 volt, okay? Across the diode, okay? That means your V output will become fixed. So whenever you have a negative cycle, okay, initially, the voltage will follow input and then this will become fixed up to 0 0.7 and then this will go like this okay so this is your this should be your uh output wave okay and this output wave is i think given as option c let me check okay so this type of option three is given option three is given so you have three volts and then you have this 0 0.7 volt. So this is option three. Okay. So option three is correct. Correct. Okay. So thank you very much.